Well, good morning, good night, or good afternoon, viewers, depending on your time zone. And this is Fellows here, too, and this is also Fellows. Going over feature thingy of the snapshot, uh, whatever it is, 13W04A. You know what I hate most? When Fraps deletes your recording, so it doesn't capture sound. <sighs> if you're wondering what that is, and what some of this stuff is, that, that shouldn't be here, like holes, giant holes, that's because this is my second time doing this. Anyway, let me just go over the features again. So, this is an update that, sorry, this snapshot had, like most snapshots in this Redstone update, they had not many features, but they added a lot of features be due to those features. Features. Um, one of those things is dispensers and droppers now can be pointed upwards and downwards, which is amazing. Uh, you could probably imagine what this does. Uh, don't worry about that stuff. You could probably imagine what this does. You know, if you put a wind shovel in here for no apparent reason, and... Okay, I broke my repeater from the last video. Ugh. Okay, well, I'm gonna start that up again. So, right here, as you can imagine, you know, upwards dispenser, boop! It shoots upwards. Also, that's a glitch. Apparently, I think this has been in for a while, but if there's a repeater thing going, like, a block away from any sort of dispenser or dropper, and it's powered, it'll just go with the same speed that's going. Glitch. But, over oh, right, I held ship. I was like, what? But right here, yep, you can actually do, little, you, you can actually fire things straight down. I love that. Dispensers, droppers, bolt the same way. Uh, droppers, if you weren't here for the last snapshot, they uh, drop items such as potions and stuff. Like, you know, if you give a cookie, a, uh, a cookie. Yeah, yeah, if you give a dispenser a cookie, it'll ask for some milk. No, if you give a dispenser an arrow and shoot it, it'll just shoot the arrow. If you give a uh, an arrow to a dropper, and it'll it'll just drop the arrow and also drop the base. I want a remix of that, dang it! Drop the base, dropper style. Anyway, I thought of a few funny little things, uh, like adding, right, like right here. Basically, these are four or actually six quick examples of what you can do with the new orientations. Right here, we have upwards. Flamethrowers, cause finally, it took. That's interesting. It took them long enough to add. It took them long enough to add fireworks. Finally, they've added upwards flamethrowers. You can actually make really cool-looking volcanoes with this stuff. I can imagine. But yes, guys, flamethrowers now go upwards. Um, here, if, in case you ever wanted to, you can spawn a crab load of slimes for no apparent reason. Uh, again, no apparent reason. But yep, also slimes still migrate, that has yet to be fixed. Right here, we have, uh, rain, death rain. Perfect time for when your world gets infested by slimes for no apparent reason. Um, and right here, we have artificial snow. I just thought this would be a fun thing, because it doesn't work the same as if, you know, you were to drop it straight down. Dropping it straight down, you know, you just fire it right down. If you fire it up, it kind of feels a little bit more like snow. Oh, excuse me. Right here, actually, speaking of straight down, we have experience shower. Oh, rub my body with those orbs. Uh, it, you know, it actually kind of looks like a shower, but yeah, that's a better looking reward room. And right here was actually supposed to be, let me grab some eggs. Here we go. We have an automate, oh, whoops, automated farm in Minecraft, even though it's a bit abusive to hit babies with their babies. Well... Wait, babies with their babies? Oh, God. On the next episode of 16 and Pregnant, chickens. Alright, but... <laughs> uh, I actually do want to say run one thing really fast. I will be going over, um... Any bugs I see, because there are 20 bugs that were made in... Anyway, there were, uh... I love how he stopped when I stopped. But, there are actually 20 bugs that have been made into features in this snapshot. And, whoops. There we go. No! I cannot spell time right. Time! Time set zero. All right, but there are 20 bugs that have been made in this features in this uh, video or in this snapshot. And if I see any any bugs that really stick out, I'll be sure to do a video on them. But I looked at it; it didn't look that like that big. Although I did notice one on my own here. Capacitors pointing out of jukeboxes actually can measure what CD you put in it. Like if it goes in order of how you see them in the creative menu, as you can see right here. Yes, guys, our music now has power. Sounds like some sort of hippie thing, power to the music. But, from 13, 
which is a, a bit a bit misleading because it only gives the redstone power of one. Because it's the first thing in the creative inventory. It only gives off one signal. But if you give it weight, it gives it off a 13th signal, ironically. Or sorry, actually a 12th signal because it's the 12th uh, music disc in the little slot. Although 11, ironically, I think gives off a power of 11. So I don't know. Uh, maybe that, maybe that's the, re maybe that's the reason this entire time, this entire time it was called 11, because it gives 11 power. That would be really, really cheap. <laughs> oh, it's this, it's this amazing track. It was full of wonder and mystery. Oh, why is it called 11? Because it gives 11 redstone power in a future update that'll be added and it has no really significant difference. But yeah, uh, they also don't have a scene to have an effect on no blocks. No love for the no blocks. Um, and this... Right here, I thought I should say, it's interesting. These are Minecraft, M Minecraft, Minecart rails, um, and they appear in the, at least in the snapshot. To, okay, well apparently not as well as I thought it would, but <laughs> they're meant to stop mobs. But apparently this chicken is a badass. Is just jumping on top of it. This chicken fears nothing. All right, but yeah, like father like son. Eventually, this little baby chicken will grow up to be a rail jumper. Take that as you will. Anyway, um. Yeah, apparently rails now scare off mobs. I don't seem to see that happening, but apparently that's a thing. You like if I do this, maybe? It'll, they'll move out of the way? Or they'll just stop it? Nope, okay. We are abducting your child! Oh god, abducting children and rail jumping. Okay, we can make some interesting stereotypes here. But I'm not going to. Um, moving on before we get into that dangerous topic. I actually blew up this area that I had a previous redstone contraption. It just give me one second to remake it. It actually won't take that many, that many seconds. But I'll go over a new feature as I'm talking here. Dispensers now have the ability to activate certain things. Um, one of those things being, just give me a second to set it up. <laughs> oh god, I know some people are going to have a really good time with this. But dispensers now have the ability... To prime TNT. Okay. <laughs> and actually create really, really powerful auto griefing tools. They grief an entire region and then destroy themselves. So yeah, that that's a good thing to add to Minecraft, right? 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 Yeah, I hope. I doubt it. I doubt it. Also, one other thing I want to go over really fast because I didn't notice this. Uh, by the way, why do these things not have a hold button? That's odd. But, right here, I thought this was a bit odd. You see, normally it's the, normally hoppers will pull from dispensers, you know, at the regular speed. You'd think, though, if a dispenser was pointing down, or a dropper at least, was pointing down, it would go a little bit faster into the, into the hopper. I don't know, my personal opinion. But yes, guys, uh, I actually know of two other things I will do that has happened, but isn't meant to have happened yet. Because don't forget, this is... I, I'm recording this after my previous recording, in which case I learned two new things. Basically, hold on. I have two clips to show you. So, uh, let's just play uh, the clip where I do this thing. Okay, wait, 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 wait. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I have to stop you for one second. Okay, Nopis, uh, one of my admins, a mod developer, a uh, great guy, he just informed me of something amazing. Okay, I have been wanting this for so long, and I think... I think it's just happened. Okay, hold on. Okay, he just told me on Skype just now that dispensers or something now can now equip armor. Please tell me this is true. Please. Oh, whoops. Please. Oh, please. Okay. Come on. If this is if this is true, I will love it. I know it won't power the top ones. Oh my god, yes! Yes, yes, yes! Oh my god, yes! It's gonna make adventure maps so much better! Oh my god, this is going right in my new minigame. Okay, wow. Um, amazing? <laughs> yes, yes, yes! Okay, now let's, let me test the, the extent of this. I want to test the extent of this. Hold on, hold on. Uh, that. Okay, hold on. Okay, so it doesn't put on pumpkins. Okay. Fair enough, fair enough. What about replacing armor with other armor? So, like, if I put in that, 
And then I was already wearing this. Okay, I'll just put that in there. Now, what if I get given two at once? Okay, I'm wearing a helmet. There we go. What if I get given two at once? Is it just random? If so, that's gonna be interesting if you can make random glasses. Damn it, I'm. Ah! I'm derping, but I'm excited. I'm excitedly derping. Hoop! Wonder if it is random or if it's something to do with, with like an ID or something. Get off my head. Hmm. Nope, it seems to be the same one every time. Of course, that could be just me derping, but. Now, what about monster heads? If this. Please tell me this is a thing. Ah, I'm a bit disappointed on that one. I won't lie, I'm a little disappointed. Because I would love, I would love to see custom heads appear on you. Okay, I'm a little disappointed by that. But, in all retrospect, I am ecstatic that that is now a thing. Okay, bravo, I love it. Alright, now, I actually, I did not say this stuff. I wanted to say this. I realized I didn't say it though, because this was after editing. I didn't address two issues I currently have with this, we have with Minecraft, and that sh at least should be fixed. First of all, Ender Pearls still can't be thrown in creative. I don't know why, but because it's a form of fast travel, I would think creative mode should have it the most. Well, I guess, it, no, it's really good for survival, but you know what I mean. And also, bats still drop nothing. Still! Come on now! You're adding so many new items and stuff, at least give bats some use. Uh... <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, I'm just excited about the armor. That's amazing stuff. Um, I think that's all I have to say. Uh, oh yeah, also, there will not be a video on the bugs. The bugs aren't that big to notice. It, I mean, they, they look like this, this general bug fixes. If I see any, like, really new bugs that become features such as this, I will do a video on it. But I currently haven't seen any because the server just came back up and I haven't just seen anything. Uh, but yeah, guys, uh, back to the outro of the previous video. Blah, blah, blah. All right, and now that he got that, now that I got that across, let me show you the clip where I do this thing. Blah, 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 blah. And I'm apparently not done. Okay, so after I closed that window and said, okay, finally done that recording. Then I hop on the Skype again, and I see Nobis told me there were more things. Okay, so apparently these guys can now use bone meal. That's a thing. So if I do this, this is filled with... Nothing but air. This is now filled with bone meal. If I stand on this pressure plate, hoop, it fires out what? And do you see all those green particles? It means the bone meal failed for the first time. See, it doesn't work. However, if I keep doing it, and keep doing it, and keep doing it, this is basically the bone meal failing. Should work, come on. Come on, that one worked. Oh, come on! Dang it! Nopis! This better work. Come on. I did it before. Ah! Alright. Maybe I have to turn it or something. Okay. But, as you can see right there, it does work. It really does work. I promise you that. Um, they also work on normal trees. They'll just, uh, like, grow them. There's nothing, like, too intense about it. But that is a thing. Right here, I assume it also works on wheat. Actually, uh, thinking about it again. Right here, this is interesting. If there is nothing in front, whoop, if there's nothing in front of the dispenser to use bone meal on, it'll be a blank, like a gun. So if, watch this. That one gave me a dirt block, or a grass block. A grass block. Grass block, come on now. Blank. It actually can fire blanks, and it won't use up the dispenser. See? You can just keep on firing blanks, and it doesn't use it up. So you can actually play Russian roulette, with, here if I do this, you can now play Russian Roulette with dirt blocks. Or actually arrows. Hey! Wait a moment, wait a moment, wait a moment, wait a moment, wait a moment. Idea. Hold on. Arrows. Full stack of arrows. Spread them out. Okay. By the way, I love that feature. I think you can now play Russian Roulette in Minecraft. Wait a moment, wait a moment. Of course it'll get stuck on the button. But of course. Oh, right. If I do... Oh, actually, that may have hit me, but I just didn't. Okay, hold on. Game mode, zero. Russian roulette, everyone. Blank! 
Starts out Russian Roulette, gets blank. Gets a blank again. You can now play Russian Roulette in Minecraft. That's amazing. Russian Roulette, for those who don't know, is a really crazy game where someone holds a gun up to their head with, with, uh... Every bullet is loaded except for one. Something like that. And basically, you have to fire it at your head. It, it's really crazy stuff. But... <laughs> that's... We can play Russian Roulette in Minecraft now. That, that's demonic. Um... Oh, God. But right here is the other thing it does. This is, as you can see, it has 62 durability. It's a fire starter. And it actually use, uses up the durability. So, yeah, you can now place fire in Minecraft. You can now grow trees automatically in Minecraft. Oh, my God. Wow. And, yeah, this just demonstrates the little green particle. Oh! That grows! Hold on! That one grows! There was a dirt block right above it! That one grows, but this stupid tree refuses to grow. Why? Why do you, why do you not love me? My God. All right, then. Now, back to the actual outro. <laughs> and yes, that is my transition to things. All right, guys. Thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoyed this. Um... I don't believe there's anything else. If, deletes, if, if this recording gets deleted, I'm gonna shoot myself with a with Russian roulette. I almost, I guess, because I thought I hadn't shown it yet, but I have showed it yet. Oh god, confusion. But uh, yes, guys, thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. That slime is stuck in the water. And do 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 do. Oh, also scoreboards. I'll be going over those later once I figure out how to activate them. Yeah. Do 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 do. See you around!